the reality of being an apprentice, a software engineering apprentice in my case, is that it is definitely sort of a steep learning curve. Um, there's a lot of things that you have to, I guess, go through and a lot of obstacles that you have to overcome. Um, so for example, it's the, the time organisation, you know, you're not just working, you're not just at university, you're balancing both. So although other people might have a Monday to Friday, nine to five, or other uni students might have, you know, lectures two hours a day, here and there, as an apprentice, you've got to juggle both. So being on this apprenticeship not only allowed me to you know, become confident in my abilities, but also portray that confidence and portray those abilities to those external, to the company that I'm currently at, and external to the experience that I've previously had. So it's definitely sort of set me up to the lifestyle that I did want to have coming into you know, the working world, into the corporate world, into becoming a software engineer. Um, and you know, the benefits that I'm going to see moving forward are just invaluable. Um, it's definitely an experience that I would recommend. A day in the life or a week in the life of an apprentice can really vary um, and I guess that's one of the good things about it. Um, so for myself, uh, if I was to look at a week, a typical week that I would have, um, so I'd have university on two days of the week and on these days there'd be lectures, labs, tutorials, anything that typical student would have on a university day. Um, the rest of the week I'd be at work um, just as a standard employee so there's no sort of um, misconception or misunderstanding about the point that I am an employee at the company that I'm at. 